What's going on, people? Gonna go ahead and commentate on some gameplay I recorded for God of War Ascension, the beta. Now, I think this is now either open or completely done, I forget which. Honestly, this video is pretty old. Like, I should have got this up a few weeks ago, but I've kind of been slacking on that. I've been working on some other footage and uh, straightening some things out with my personal life. So, I haven't really gotten around to it, but no one wants to hear about all that crap, so let's talk about this game. Um, much like Anarchy Reigns, I don't really have all that much to say about it, because, I mean, for one, I went into this with the mentality that I go into some games that I feel are just single-player experiences that focus on, or not that focus on, that decide to toss in multiplayer, and that's what I feel this is. Like... There are other modes it has to offer, and maybe with, like, the armor customization and stuff like that. Like, right here, I'm in a tutorial and whatnot, kind of just teaching myself how to play, because it's much like the single player, but you can also do some other stuff. Like, the moves are ever so slightly different, and as you can see here, you can pick different armors, different weapons, you can customize stuff, you know, things that bring you back to play more than a few matches of multiplayer. And it seems like it'd be fun for a little while, but I don't see how it, it would be a uh, a lasting thing, or at least for me personally. Part of it, too, is that, you know, you want to try to have other people with this game, and I just don't honestly see myself with that many people who are going to want to play this. That being said, um, that's not to say it's bad. It's actually kind of fun, but again, I don't I don't really see it lasting for too long. It, it, it wouldn't it wouldn't be something I paid sixty bucks for. Put it that way. Like the thing is, like games are expensive now, obviously, and uh, I mean they have been. Economy's tough, blah blah blah, and you know you get a job, you're good to go, you get games. I don't know. I've been a lot more critical. Ever since I've been doing these videos and trying to do reviews and whatnot, I've been a lot more critical over the games I get. And, you know, this is, this might appeal to some people. Like, I have similar feelings right now towards Gears of War Judgment. Now, I kind of wish I had a beta with that because I would be able to test that out and actually get probably a few people to test it with me. That I might get if for no other reason to play with friends. I But don't quote me on that if by some chance, uh, you know, your name is Carolyn Laura or... Anybody else who actually plays Gear still, uh, don't quote me on that because I honestly don't know that that's going to happen at all. Because again, you know, much like this game, you know, it, it, I'm gonna play, I'm gonna play Overrun, and then there's gonna be less to do in the game. You know, like I, I, I just don't see it lasting. Is is really what it comes down to. I, I really would like to. Like, the games that I don't just rent, the ones that I own, I'd like them to last. And that being said, you know, a lot of single-player games don't last. You just kind of play them and then put them down, unless I really enjoy them, and then I'll probably, like, trophy whore them. Which, you know, might be the case with this God of War game as well. I'm honestly looking more forward to the single-player demo, which I think I might be in. I'm not really quite sure. I signed up for the thing kind of late, and technically my quote-unquote team won. So, I think I'll be a part of that, in which case there'll be another video for that one. I'll try to get that one up quicker. So, as you can see, we're about to jump into a match here. I kind of just, you know, scroll around, saw what I could do, pick my character. I did a few matches before this, but honestly, I didn't do too great. I don't even think I do too great in this one either, to be honest. Um, but I did pick the sword as opposed to the hammer. The hammer, of course, is stronger, but it is slower. So, take that for what you will. It didn't work out very well for me. So, I decided to go ahead and go with the sword. It's kind of interesting, some of the stuff you can do in here. Like, this is just straight-up deathmatch. I actually did try... I didn't record it either way, but it, I really kind of wish I did. I was trying to play Domination or Capture the Flag or whatever it is in this game. Because they offered it temporarily and whatnot. And what ended up happening is I ended up facing off against this one guy while I was trying to find wherever the flag was. And I got him low on health so you can execute him. So I stuck my sword through him and then the game disconnected. So I'm guessing he uh, rage quit and wasn't too happy with what I did to him. 
And there goes me falling off. Yeah, you can get knocked off, you can get like ring out, you can kill him normally, and then you can also execute or just... You can kill them normally, just keep hitting them when they're like down or whatever, or you can go ahead and get an execution, which is pretty cool. Uh, you got these special attacks you can switch between, which is also pretty cool. That's kind of different from the single player. Um, you can get ring out. You can knock people against these walls here for like a different kind of execution, I guess. I, there's some stuff that's different. I just, I don't know. It just seems like something that would wear off pretty quickly, or at least for me anyway. Like, Tomb Raider's another one that's going to randomly have multiplayer. And, I don't know, I just don't see it. I mean, maybe... Maybe it's just me. I mean, I know there's some people who, uh... Who feel the same way. There's some people who don't. And by all means, I mean, this is not... It's not bad. It's really not bad. I can't say I'd recommend it to any of my, like, close friends or whatever, but... It's certainly not a bad thing. But on that same note, as I kind of keep repeating myself here, I mean, if you if you have if you have friends but to play this with, then by all means, this seems like it could be kind of fun because I mean, it is kind of a lot of comparisons are made to Power Stone, which is conveniently why I mentioned Anarchy Reigns, where Anarchy Reigns I feel shouldn't have really bothered with uh, single player. I mean, it was it was decent, but it was meant to be a multiplayer game. And plus, that game also offers a lot more multiplayer modes than this game does. Uh, this game just stuck in multiplayer, you know, just because it could. I know part of their challenge was to make people not feel that way. And I don't want to say that they, uh... I don't want to say that they didn't accomplish that, but as far as, like, keeping my attention, I just don't see it. It's like I said, I'm much, I'm much, I'm much more looking forward to the single player demo as opposed to this, where I'm kind of just swinging around and hoping for the best here, trying to face off against three other people who probably have had this beta longer than I have and have more equipment and more stuff and you know, just just more mindless online grinding for parts and weapons and stuff. Oh, I like that. I like that quote there. That's good stuff. See, they're, they're implying that I was sucking because, you know, I'm laying on my back so I keep dying. That being said, I mean, I do get a few decent kills here. It's kind of cool to use the special abilities or to go ahead and execute somebody, but of course you're left open for that, kind of like Gears. And this guy just knocked me out of the stage. It's really annoying. I wish I could do that more often. Then again, he had the hammer. I have a, I have a freaking sword, so it's not gonna happen as often, I guess. But yeah, I'm not really sure what else to say that I haven't already said. There. Really isn't much to be said. <laughs> but. I guess that'll do it for uh, these impressions. I'll go ahead and let the match finish out just so you can guys can take a look at it and whatnot. But it is what it is. And unfortunately with the demo, I, like I said, I did play a few matches, but this was the only stage I was able to play at the time. I wish I could have shown Domination as well, but the guy rage quit, plus I wasn't recording anyway. So there really wouldn't have been much to show there. And plus, um, it seems, it even says flat out, like, on the side when you start up the game, that there's only certain times that... I, I don't want to say the game wouldn't work if you didn't play on those certain times, but it's suggested to play at those times, because I guess that's when the most people are on, or the servers are most functional, or... I don't know. I wouldn't be too concerned about that, though, because, generally speaking, Sony first-party titles have uh, pretty good connections. So with that being said, I believe this match is about to uh, finish, and I lost. I did ever so slightly less worse in this match, but still not great.
anyway, that's all I got to say. Take care, guys.